Now let's head out to Local 5's Bryn Carmen. She's outside a home in New Providence, right where that wild weather video was shot. It was a normal afternoon for the couple, but when the storms got worse, Dennis came outside to take a picture. That's when he spotted a tornado just a few miles away touched down. Watching the tornado form, at first it was fascinating to watch, and then it did get scary for a moment. One, because, you know, I know the people who live there, and I know the people who live there, and I thought it looked like it was headed to their farm. Dennis and Marlene Reese are no strangers when it comes to tornadoes, but seeing one up close and personal was a first. And I saw the tornado start to form in the clouds, and then uh, it really formed, and you could see the tornado come down, and I think it touched the ground once, and then went back up in the clouds, and then it came down a second time. Dennis was in the backyard taking this video on his phone. Marlene, on the other hand. We have a place, we have a basement where she goes. <laughs> but Marlene was too worried about her husband to take shelter. He called me on his cell phone and said, there's a tornado west of us, and I suggested he come inside and go to the basement. But as you saw, that didn't happen. Uh, he does have some fantastic footage, but I told him that he probably would be found with his cell phone in his hand and a really good video of the tornado. The tornado didn't hit either farm and dissipated. Dennis remembers the aftermath of the tornado that hit this community about 20 years ago. He is thankful history didn't repeat itself. I have seen the aftermath, and that will make a believer out of you when you see that. The couple and the entire community are relieved that even though a tornado touched down, there are no reports of damage. Reporting in New Providence, Bryn Carmen, Local 5 News, we are Iowa.